the American rapper Post Malone, nope, me neither, released an album last week that went straight in at number one. Now, to be honest, I haven't heard any of his music because he's a rapper and I'm not a fan of that genre of music. For me, there's no real musical prowess in making obscenities rhyme whilst talking over a backing track. Also, his music is played on popular radio stations, and I don't listen to chart music because if I hear any of it, I'm usually filled with an urge to kill everyone in the area, including myself. However, fans of Post Malone took to Twitter to commend him on discovering a new artist, because like so many artists, he couldn't record an album on his own, he had to do a number of collaborations. Now, this undiscovered artist, I won't name him yet, but some of the things that were said on Twitter were, who the fuck is this guy? It's so good that Post Malone shines a light on unknown artists. Another person commented, oh, he done so good for his first song. Another guy said, he gonna be huge, now he recorded with Post Malone. Now, this guy, this unknown artist, um, he's actually British, he's from Birmingham. His name's John, John Osborne. Um, and for the people who know him, and I know he's unknown, but maybe 10 or 12 people have heard him before, John Osborne normally goes under the nickname Ozzy Osborne. Ozzy fucking Osborne, the Prince of Darkness, and these fucktards thought Post Malone had discovered him. Now, Ozzy is probably the most notorious frontman of all time, and was also the singer in Black Sabbath, the band that fucking invented heavy metal. In fact, any heavy metal song now, you can guarantee whatever riff they're playing owes something to early Sabbath. So Post Malone, he's a rapper. Even if his next ten albums go double platinum, he still isn't fit to wipe Ozzy's ass. I'm not sure why Ozzy collaborated with him, but I suspect it's because Ozzy hasn't really known what's going on since about 1983. But the same, is it just rap fans are thick as shit? Because the same thing occurred a few years ago with Kanye West, that pointless fuck trumpet, when he recorded a song with someone they'd never heard of, and that was Paul fucking McCartney. Half of Lennon and McCartney, the most influential songwriting duo of all time, and a member of the fucking Beatles, and they thought he was unknown. Now, I can't say anything about Post Malone because I haven't heard his music. All I know is he looks a bit like a heroin addict. Whereas Kanye West... The only reason he's not the biggest prick in the entire world is because he's married to the worst person in the world, Kim Sodding Kardashian. <laughs>